You know who that is? No. That's a hornbill, an Abyssinian ground hornbill. Really? Yes. And, and, and do you have a lot of them? We just have the two, actually. But we hope to have more when they breed and have eggs, and then we hatch the eggs. Merrily, they're going to have a lot of eggs and little babies. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're hoping to have babies, and that's one of the things they try to do here. They help the animals to reproduce. That's right, that's right. So we encourage all that we can of natural kind of surroundings so that they'll think they're in the wild and go and lay eggs in the areas that they choose. Because there's not enough of them? That's right. They're very, there's very few of them left in the wild. And there she is behind us there. Wow, yeah. look at her Merrily Dawn. Yeah. She's so funny. <laughs> she is. Do you see all that blue on her? She's got bubbles on her neck. She does. That's called a throat sac. And they can inflate that and deflate it. And why would they do it? It's just for display. All for oh, display. When they want to look beautiful. That's right. That's it's like right. Jewelry. That's right. It's their it's their jewelry. What's on top of their beak? That's a good question. That's called a cask. And they're called a horn bill, but they don't blow any air out of that or anything. It actually takes in some of the vibration from the vocalizations they make. They make a oh. deep vocalization, like and a... And they like to mm -hmm. knock on things. They do like to knock. She likes to bang her beak on everything. Because she's happy I'm here. That's exactly <laughs> right. She's very happy.